That's because we have. That's because. That's because. No. We have no jurisdiction here. I'm. We are in their building right now. Oh, their building. How much they pay for it? Oh, you want us to? Oh, no, we're not. All right, guys. Welcome to Auditing America. We here. We live. Big one. CPR, Mr. America, First Amendment Audit, the Tiagos. Can you tell us what services you guys provide in this building? No, are you um, recording me? Yes. I can't do that. Why? Because you can't, this is a government building. You're not allowed to do that. You're not even allowed to be recording right now. Yeah, you can. <laughs> no, you cannot. Why not? Because this is a government building and you're not allowed to do that. This, is have, that like a new rule? We have our own rights. Yeah. I can choose to let you record me or not. What right? The right for you to come in here and be recording me first and foremost. Well, I'm not trying to be rude, but this is a public area. And this is, no, it's not. It's a government it's building. It's prohibit. It's prohibit. You're what, not supposed to be, record what, what, of us. What law is that, ma'am? Yeah. It doesn't matter what law what it is. Law. Of course. You have to, you have to say no, what law. No, I don't. First off, you have to have my permission to be recording me right or wrong. No, not, yes, only yes. if I'm in your, in your private you're, property. Yeah, you're, right, right now, are you recording yeah. me right now? I am because you're you're hired by the public. You're and in a public no, space. And you're not. Then you're not. You don't have my permission. First off. Well, I mean to record me at all. I understand that, but I you don't need have, it. But so what I'm saying is, I can have you, the people to let you know from the jump that you can't. This is a public. You're right. This is a public building, but it's not open to the public. This is a government building. You have to have permission to film in here. Ma'am, I have to. With all due respect, I have to disagree, because okay, uh, okay. we I'm have sorry. the we have the First Amendment. And your first amendment, you're violating mine already because you walked in recording Specifically, me. which right am I violating? You're, did you ask me to record me? Well, did you're you in a public ask, building now. No, but did you ask to record? We have the right to video record no, the government. No, no, you don't. Yeah, we do. You don't have the right to record This me. is not North Korea, ma'am. This care, is America. It's not, it's we not, could it's film. Right, but I'm not about to argue with you about it. But no, I mean, neither, but I'm just I'm just saying. Can y'all get uh, the site troopers in here up here? I'm why why are you calling the police? You shouldn't be recording me, and I'm definitely about to let my supervisor know that you're here recording because that's not how that's supposed to be. Ma'am? We have freedom of the press. Nah, I'm not your freedom of the press. Nothing, but if you didn't come in and press, ask me, I gotta like, say record me. If yeah, I didn't say record me, you can't do that. Only if we're in private place. No. We're in no, a. Look, look at this. Look at this. It right. says Van Rijn Center for Government. And yeah, that's different. Right. That's different. I'm sorry. That's different. Like, can you? I understand, ma'am, but this uh, you, we you we are allowed to. The one is recording me, been recording me since he walked in the door. We actually turned his camera. Yeah, he's recording both of us, and then he want to argue with us why he can't record us. I'm not arguing. I'm just, I'm just saying. I get that, but sir, please. He's recording on his phone. I don't even know what he's trying to do. I told you we have freedom of the press. He has freedom That's of the true. press. Is what he keeps Outside saying. Outside there. In here too. This is my workspace. You guys, you guys are hired by us. No. Yes, you are. No. Can you please not record? He's still recording. Like, I'm actually not I'm gonna have you to me. delete all the whatever bit from me and my. He said, come to this phone right here. You can come over here, right I, here. I, I don't want to talk to him over the phone. If he wants to talk to me, he could come over here. He's trying to, he, he just want to record you, Kev. I'm so serious. Like, and I done, I asked him not two multiple times, and he want to argue about the First Amendment. So he, he's like, I asked him not to record me. Me and Flo both has asked him. No, he don't, he, no, he walked up to me and asked him what we do in this business, in this building, and start recording, and he was already recording. And I asked him, you can't, I let him know that he cannot record in here. And he still, uh, his right, freedom of the press he's still recording right now it's okay if you don't know but we have the right no i'm sorry but like i don't want to be in no video for my own privacy no, i don't say you had the right we do he didn't say you had the right he said y'all just want to record what y'all don't want to do anything he's yeah we do right. yeah we do we're here for a business and we have to and we have the right to record our business here i do you have an appointment with the governor right now i do not then you're not going to the governor's floor you have to have an appointment to go to the Okay, so we're, we want. See what I'm saying, Kev? We want to make an appointment then. If you want to make an appointment, you go to the our website, you find out the other website. Yeah, public records request as well. Okay, and this ain't the place for you to access. Yes, it is. This is this is the place. This is not the building for public records. For one, I'm gonna say I'm, I'm just trying to be real lean with y'all because you're already violating my rights. No, we're not. Yes, you are. No, we're not. Which right is that? You don't even yes. know. Yes. Okay. Huh. 
Oh, so you were wrong. I wasn't wrong. Yeah. You just said it. I'm sorry, but like, Okay. I'll just wait for you. I'm going to Actually, we want him to get here because we're going to complain. Huh? We're going to complain. You can't just come and tell me what to do and what not to do. I don't work for you, ma'am. Correct, because we have freedom of the press, and there's a public building. We I'm have to. Telling you, don't put it on me. Don't speak to the okay. camera. Okay. All right. So what did he say, ma'am? Oh, now we're not speaking, right? What do you say? No, it's not. But specifically, what's not okay? It's We're not, not doing okay. anything wrong. Don't, don't put your camera on me. Quit talking. Don't even say You know there's thousands watching right now, by the That's way. That's fine, but you still violating my rights. I'm not. You then then, then call the police. I don't have to call the police. I asked you nicely not to report me. That's exactly you're saying I'm violating your rights? You call the police? I'd like, to, I'd like to have my rights violated so I can go into the side place. You can't go in something. He told me all I have to do is get a pass from him. You can't. I'd like to speak to your supervisor. You I just explained to you that the governor's office, you have to have enough. Okay, but that's not... That also what other services? There. He's also, the realty commission is there. And, you, and realty? Are, Real estate? Is that what you about to say? Real estate is no longer in this building. Thank you. So again, I don't have to address nothing with you. I swear to you. I swear to God, you're gonna get fired. How? Because we have thousands watching, and all, all I need to do is to get everybody to complain on you, ma'am. You won't be the last. I you I'll, you I won't. No, you didn't. You're violating our rights. I'm gonna ask you one, I'm gonna ask you one more question. No, uh, I can't ask that. Okay, okay no. that's fine. How does it? How does it feel uh, after people fought for people's civil rights to be enforcing? The lack of rights from the man. We're staying here till five. That's fine. Stay here. You're perfectly fine. I'm not staying here at five. I got other things to do. But no, just no, no, we're staying here till five. Allied Universal swear they, they're police officers. Can, I, but, I need a look. supervisor. Are you a supervisor? No, no. Can you tell? Okay. okay. So what you come here for? I did not deny him an entry. Yeah, you did. I told him that he asked to go to the government. We have the right. Well, we, we have the right to enter. Government. What's your name, ma'am? I don't have one. You don't have one. We're gonna find you out. You would never. Thank we, you. we will. I'm not even filming myself. I oh, now she's filming, filming exactly what we what she said we couldn't do. Now she can. Said, uh, no, I'm not filming y'all, but it, uh, my thing is I'm not recording. But I did the same thing. How you feel? Yeah. 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 I'm offended. Actually, I'm glad that you learned something. Um, can I please have access to a public building? You're gonna deny me. Are you gonna deny my rights? Because we I have the right to come in here. Do you have an appointment at the 34th floor? No, I do not. I'm, All right. I'm not only here Look, bro. What services do you provide? Let's start off by by that. What are service? You, are don't feed it into that. Like, don't feed it into what, money? guys? Please. Deny people rights? Uh, does that make you happy at night to go home? I, I Florence, to guys, I need you to complain on Florence. Here we go. Here we go. Officer, thank you. Okay, good. Officer. Stop. Yeah. Yeah. That person's being that person's being disorderly. Disorderly, disturbing our peace. Well, that's because you just got here and we have it on video. So why don't you just tell me, can you play the video, sir, so we can see somebody being disorderly? What you see, you guys will never. I bet you don't know the Third Amendment. What's the Third Amendment? Because if you don't know the Third Amendment, you're not qualified for, for this job. What's the Third Amendment? You don't know it. Don't know By it. the way, there's yeah. thousands watching. You don't know it. Yeah. You don't know it. So they're the ones that tell us who has access to the building. 
So you work for a security company, you're not an officer of the law? They are the ones who control the, the Allied Universal is just a cheap company that we hire. Okay? Huh? But we have the right to walk here freely that we're trying to prove a point. That's what we're saying. Yeah. Proving a point that this is the people's building. Correct. And we have the Fourth Amendment. This is a Fourth Amendment violation. We are this is a Fourth Amendment violation. I want to know if she knows the Third Amendment. Do you know the Third Amendment? Oh, it does matter because a lot of people die for these rights. That's what? Right. Yeah, yeah. You know people that went that veterans. You know veterans. Are you a veteran? That doesn't matter. I am. Oh, then you should care about uh, about the Constitution. Why? You, if you're a veteran, if you're a veteran, why are you pe getting people to waive their rights into this building? You're supposed to protect those. Yeah, you know that. You're 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 you're, you're supposed to uphold the Constitution, right? You're supposed to uphold the Constitution, right? How come, how come we're being denied? You see, I just told you that somebody's being disorderly and you said, well, I didn't see it. That's because cops are not there. When the bad people are there, you usually get a call. I don't give a damn what she is. She's in charge of arresting whoever's being disorderly, okay? And she don't want to make a proper investigation. She said, well, I didn't see anything. Just like the guy that stole the car. You didn't see him, but you're still looking for him, right? What's the Third Amendment? Go ahead. What's the Third Amendment? That's all I want to know. You don't know your job. You don't, bro. I'm not your bro. Employee. Oh, you want us to? Oh, no, we're not stepping. Actually, they didn't. They say we could stay here all day. Okay. We're, we're, you see, we're arguing the fact that you're not letting us in. So you're giving wrong information. The ones that tell us who to let in here. Okay. Well, they already said that we're allowed to be here all day. And they have no authority. They're ally universal. They're being disorderly. And you don't care. How can some... They are being disorderly. Don't you want to watch my video? No, thank you. Oh, that's because it doesn't benefit you. But guess what? I have not seen a crime. That's because I have it on... Columbus. That's because we have... That's because... No. have no jurisdiction here. We are in their building right now. Oh, their building. How much they pay for it? I don't know. This is a public building, ma'am. You, ha you have no clue. Columbus Universal Police Department is where you want to take your video to, sir. Ma'am, that's you. Stay, no, stay, you. stay Highway Patrol right here. You're a cop, right? If I break the law, you take me, right? Huh? Stand by. You guys are tyrants. You don't know your job. You don't. You went to war or a veteran. You don't know what the hell the Third Amendment this is. The funny part about it is you guys all swore an oath to a document that you know nothing about, and you're violating people's rights. Like right. Nineteen thirteen four seventy. What did you advise? Twelve forty two. They were over at the atrium. They wanted to know where the governor's office was. I think they were just worried about recording, and they're allowed to record, but. Oh, I thought we weren't. I thought the people. I, I thought we weren't. You are still. Oh, now we are. I don't know where. Magically, magically, we're. I never told you you weren't allowed to record. I said they were being disorderly. You said I didn't see it. You don't want to see it either. You're a tyrant. You're a tyrant. You're not qualified for the job. You're not qualified for the job. Why? No, they already talked to their supervisor. You see, you're at, you're a cop and you're asking. You don't even know what the hell's going on. This is a public place. They don't have authority over us. They already know that we have the right to be well, here. I believe they already told you that that was your right. Did you want Columbus Police Department to be called? For what? What are you What are you asking for right now, I guess? Look, uh, Kitty said, just, he already said that he's staying in this lobby too okay. long. Oh, oh, okay. okay, that's oh, what I was Oh, um, oh, unless oh. He, and, and he said when he get here, he'll talk to them if they don't. Then oh. Or unless you're disorderly. Oh, oh disorderly. Like oh, but you didn't see that, right? Oh, unless they accuse me, right? What if no, they accuse sir. me and you didn't see it? Sir, it would only be Sir, nothing. Thought. Sir, nothing. We're gonna. What's your name and batch number? I'm Trooper Winans. What's your batch number? You can't read that. No. That's how you would speak to a judge? No. 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 Okay. Then I'm your boss. What's your number? My badge number is five ninety three. You're not qualified for this job, okay? Do the walk of shame. Do the walk of shame. You don't even know what you. No. You don't know what you signed up for. About a document that you swore no to and you didn't even read. And the only thing about good about you is your haircut. You like my haircut? The only good thing about you is your haircut. Yep. 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 That's so funny. You know, people fought for a right to have them, and for you to side with the government is terrible. Yep. 
Yep. Yeah. This 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 You're person is. Through an emergency door. This person. Correct, but you wouldn't notice that because you're a terrible cop. You don't know how to investigate, okay? When somebody says, my peace has been disturbed, okay? You take a second. You don't dismiss the possible victim, ma'am. You, look at this guy, showed up with a German Shepherd now. What well, do you need a dog, a dog here for? A what? He's a bomb dog. He's stationed here. Okay. Not for you. Okay, well, it, it, it makes me feel highly uncomfortable, by the way. Doors right there? No, the, you can go too because you're the one working for us. Yeah, well, we pay for this. And the dog. There you go. Look at this one. This one don't know either anything. He don't know the third. I, don't, I understand that. Yeah, I don't, I just want to let you know Kenny supposedly is on his way. Yeah, Kenny. Okay. Kenny. Let's talk to Kenny. They've told them that they can sit here. They've told them. They've told them. We know this. We know this. You don't need to tell us anything. We know this. The ones that don't know the information is you. I've been off duty for I'm off duty too. Oh, you've been off duty. So do the walk of shame. We don't need you here. Go home. Yeah, take a break. Go read the Constitution and come back with, Come back ready for work tomorrow. Yeah. Let me guess. If we complain on you, it's personnel matter, right? It's, it's not public information. Let me guess. I can request that? You can complain all you want. Yes, sir. Can I request the outcome? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Good. Good. What happened? Supervisor. Who's this? Supervisor. I don't care about him. I, I don't care about him. Are you are, are you the supervisor? Are you a captain, sergeant, or something like that, sir? You see, you're rude. What job do you get to do? Whatever you want, treat the people with disrespect. Police officers. That's no, you. All right. So, what's your name, sir? How's that? Trooper. I, trooper what? Trooper. No. You, it's. It, you see, you guys are all about the rules and the law until it until it applies to you. You guys go around asking for people for ID all day long. I ask you for your ID. It's part of your policy to identify yourself, but you choose to say trooper because your ego is too high to, to identify to me. No. Yeah. The, me she, I asked her, she's like, well, it's right there. You can't read. You guys are all rude. And you don't know the third amendment. What's the third amendment? Quartering troops. Okay, you looked it up earlier? No. Okay, good then, good, good. I'm, I'm, I'm glad you know, hey man, hey. He knows the third amendment. First cop and, and, and how many? 25. Thank you very much. The last 25 cops don't know the third amendment. This guy don't know the third amendment either. He don't know it. Nobody knows it. So guys this, guy went to, this guy went to yeah, the military. He don't know it. Responsibility. Well, obviously, that's why we're doing this because a constitutional no. republic is your you, you, responsibility. Yes, my responsibility is to be here because obviously, as you're aware, there's a constitutional republic. Yes. And obviously, as you're aware, this is participatory. Participatory. Wait, wait, wait. It's a participatory. Let me say thing. something. Sure. I am so glad you said constitutional republic. Instead of a democracy. Thank yes, you. Yes, this is a good cop here. Now, the problem we're having here is in order to make this participatory, right, and uh, as our founding fathers envisioned, we need to be able to come in. We need to have transparency. We need to have access to our representatives. We need to have access to public records requests. I don't, I don't disagree with that. There's no representatives here. Well, no, no, this, this lady doesn't know That's what fine. disorderly conduct well, man, means. Also, too, these I people mean, right here were being disorderly. All right, hold on. That's, yo, you're the supervisor for these people? people. Yeah. Okay, how are you, brother? I'm Enrique. I'm Kenny, how you doing? Uh, nice to meet you, brother. Look, bro, we go around places looking for first reactions. This is not our first video with Allied Universal, okay? Oh, you're good. We have videos that have hundreds of thousands of video, uh, views on the internet because of disorderly conduct by security officers who are supposed to keep the peace, okay? We explained to her, we didn't come here and not say a word. We came here and, I, and we actually explained everything we're doing. Why is she calling the police? Why is she making the, uh, why is she disturbing our peace, bro? Yeah, and that's why I'm here. We're gonna, we're gonna get this then, once the, it goes, and you know, 200,000 people see it, and at least even if a thousand people call, uh -huh. That is a big deal for you guys if they just keep calling and complaining and complaining. Yeah, and complaining yeah, 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 yeah. Please talk to her. Please like, talk to her. This is not a good day to pick this. I just want to do a public records request and be on my way. Well, that's fine. With whom? Just whoever the admin, the clerk. Did you check in over here yet? So we went in here because one person initially freaked out and wasn't unaware of our first amendment rights. They called, they said we could be here filming to five if they want. And we also talked to that officer, it's fine. They said it's fine to film. We know it's fine to film. We They're being know. disorderly, but we have a police so, officer okay. over here that's... So don't do that to my friend though too, but... He's, well, I know, but I can't I know, hear but still, you if he's I understand, speaking. but still, that's kind of disrespectful. Super we rude, super rude. And talking over your friend is not rude? It's for it's the first amendment. We do that, we do that all the time. It's he's the first amendment. Friend, so we, he can tell me whatever. But here's the point, here's the and main point. So is me going. 
Paul but you're at work, somewhere. not me. All right, I'm nitpicking here, but the important thing is, um, when we came in here, because by virtue we're filming, they didn't want to grant us access. And then we've been told by several different supposed authorities that we actually do have the right to record. I don't even necessarily need to record. I'm not recording. I just want to be able to go in, obtain my public record request, and not even fill it out here. I just did want to you, take it and be on my way. Again, so you did or did not check in with them? I haven't had the opportunity to. Oh. Who gives authority to Allied that. Universal? They left. <laughs> and so the supervisor, this oh my God! I need a badge, right? First of all, there's a violation of the Fourth Amendment writing my name down right now on this, but I'm willing to violate my The Fourth First Amendment, Amendment is gone. The the Second Amendment is gone. The the, the, the Third Amendment, Amendment, they don't know it. And the Fourth Amendment is gone. You can file a public request online. That's Half true. of the goddamn Bill of Rights is gone once you enter here. <laughs> Which, again, it's not that I don't understand, but when there's avenues given, reasonable, what they'll call reasonable avenues, which they've given you which online reasonable? if you don't want to have to come and present an ID to come in. If you don't want to do that, then you go online and they sure. consider okay. that a let's reasonable just, let's just accommodation. Say, let's just say I will agree to disagree or even agree with you there. That's fine. However, my business in the first place is photography. Because the First Amendment should be allowed in a, in a building. We should be able to come in here and even take pictures. Even a building? Who owns this building? No, no. You said in a building. No, no, no. I'm, I'm only speaking here specifically okay. about for public, public buildings. buildings. Yes, okay. I don't. <laughs> if anybody comes on your property, you're all within your rights to do whatever Agreed. you want with them. Agreed. I just make sure. Yeah. No, but any public building, we should be able to come in here, uh, unabridged by the Fourth and Second Amendment. But we're willing to, to waive our rights right now. We just want to take a couple pictures and then be on our way. I understand that, but they have policies and they have somebody they policies, as you know, because you're you're the, one of the you're that. one of the most well versed police officers or troopers. Uh, that I've, I've ever dealt with, quite frankly. We've asked probably 30 cops. They don't know the Third Amendment, so it's, it's good that you do. However, the problem is the fact that you know our rights and are still going to not allow us into that building actually hurts me on a personal level because I know that you're better than that. It's it's not that. Stand by. Uh, so got um, Pat's on his way down. He's with Alsa Reps, so he'll be able to do the uh, part you were talking about with the. Uh, Okay, so just for clarification purposes. That way you don't have to give up an ID. Well, also They're trying to make a reasonable is, accommodation. Part of the thing is, I mean, take a look at this, right? So it's just like the state house, right? So there's a statue over there. There's a bust of some dude. I don't know who that is, right? All the art, all the escalators, all this stuff yeah, is paid yeah. for by us. His, his name's right over there. Okay. And actually that bust wasn't paid for by taxpayer dollars. Was it a donation? You know what? That's fair. However, We're going to complain on you. Check in. Okay. Thank you. I thought we couldn't come in. Oh, now we can't come in. Everything is no, magic no. out of nowhere. No, no. No, no. What? If you guys are here because they were being disorderly when we got here with cameras. First, the problem was the camera. Now, no, no, no. The camera is fine. No. Then we have to. The problem is the ID. First, they say no. You can't come in. Now we can come in. What the hell is going on here? Look at this lady. <laughs> That's why we have 100 million views on the internet. 100 million. Oh yeah. We have over 10 million hours of content, played content. Oh yeah. Bad cops give me Cuban, Cuban link chains. Bad cops get me gold chains. And I don't even have to sue. Because I don't need the people's money. You see, I can make my own money. You see, I have a company that pays me for catching you guys doing the wrong thing. This guy don't know the Third Amendment. We asked him earlier. She don't know the Third Amendment. Then I accused them of being disorderly, right? Because what about my piece? She said, I didn't see that. Are you guys everywhere all the time? Half of the crimes that you're investigating, though, you, you weren't there. That's so correct. so how, how, how is that? Well, I didn't see it. Bye. She failed to she failed to uh, to investigate when I told her I had it on video. Okay. So, and she's over there real happy. Does Look. Does she have a warrant for your video? Am I denying you guys to watch the video? So we can watch every video. Am I the, I'm, have I denied? So you would let us watch every video on your on your phone? What do you think? What, what, what do you th oh, did I did, did, did I forget to tell you that a hundred million people have already watched my videos? I, 
I'm, I heard you. This video I'm is going to go public. It's a, it's a slippery slope. Bro. No, there's no slippery that. nothing. The only thing that's slippery right now is her job on the line, okay? Because once hundreds of people start calling and complaining on police officers, guess what happens? Don't know. Well, what happens in every job when enough people complain on a person? What happens? I'm not sure. You get fired, sir. That's why you don't. You wouldn't know. You don't see people getting fired ever because police officers can get away with whatever. You guys, you guys stand looking real good in the graduation, right? From from your academy or whatever it is that you go to, and and you swear that you're gonna protect something you have no clue about. What's you, forty five eleven two one three? You tell me. You have a driver's license. You tell me. Do you have a driver's license? I do. Okay, that's a traffic law. It's your responsibility to know that. Why don't you know that, sir? Because I'm not an attorney, okay? And I'm not the one... You, uh, you, don't need a, you don't need to be an attorney. You signed something saying that you would be familiar with traffic law. Correct. And you sign so, up and, and you sign so up to protect the Constitution. You sign up to protect the Constitution and most of you guys don't know it. I mean, are we supposed to... Did we're, I know we're not, it? We're not, we're not supposed to know every law. Did I know it? You knew it. Yes, you are supposed to know every law. No, we're not. When you sign the paper saying... Not every traffic law. Yes, no. every traffic law. No, no. You will obey no, no, all traffic no, laws. No, no, no. Uh, hey... That the law is the law. If you break it, you broke it, and you have to pay to society. But I'm not expected to know it. Yes. No, I'm not, because expected. if I don't know it, you're not. I, if I tell you right now I don't know it, you're not going to take my license away. Ignorance of the law was not an excuse. Correct. That applies to both of us. Agreed. <laughs> it applies to everybody. So we're the one quizzing you guys. You mm -hmm. see? Ignorance of the Constitution is not an excuse. We come here, and, and we don't have the First Amendment, we don't have the Second Amendment, we, you guys don't know the Third I, Amendment, I, I, and we don't have the Fourth Amendment either. I'm, I'm confused. How do you not have the First Amendment? <laughs> Why do you think you guys are here right now with German shepherds and tyrant cops? Because they started being disorderly as soon as we walked in with the camera. Now we have to... I'm sorry. I'm, I'm coming in on the, on the middle of this, this movie. I'm, These I'm people were being disorderly, movie. okay? Okay. That's how it started. Somebody was committing a crime in here that you guys failed to investigate. These people are being disordered. They still don't get it. Look, acting weird. There you go. Boom. Then there's things like, you can't film. You can't film. We're going to call the police. That's disturbing our peace. Okay. I, I know that you are, uh, it's, it's clear in your head because you were here or whatever, but you just stop using pronouns, please. Okay. What do you want me because to do? You're skipping either you're either you're skipping parts of your story or your story doesn't make sense. What doesn't make sense to you specifically? You said we came in here, they started acting disorderly because of our first amendment. Yeah. Okay. But then you said there was a crime being committed. Correct. Be they were being disorderly. Okay. That's a crime. I, I missed the part. Yeah. What disorderly? Disorderly. They were disturbing our peace. They're saying, they're saying we can't film here. They're denying our, our service. They're supposed to be courteous and professional. They're not. They're calling the police on us. That's disturbing our peace. Yeah, I can say, I can say my peace is not at the best right now. Yeah. Okay. Also, they're wasting resources because you guys should be looking for people with warrants, not guys with cameras. You came over here because of us. There wasn't a single cop here until we got here. That is not true. Really? Yeah, yeah. She showed up after. She was here. She's posted here. She wasn't standing there? Get the video. Okay, get the video. I guarantee you there's somebody set here. Okay. okay. All right, then. Fine. All right, cool. But guess what? The person you have there doesn't know our rights either. So it's not qualified for the job. Not qualified. How, how often do you guys get uh, brush up on the Constitution? Not too often. You know how long it takes to become a barber? About 1,500 hours. And then how long it takes to become a cop? About 700 hours. So how, why is it if you guys have you more counting, responsibility? Hold on, hold on. Are you counting just academy time or academy time plus coach pupil period? I don't know, but I know uh, for well, a fact that cops, I know, I know for a fact that it's that? real easy to become a cop. Okay. That's real so easy. I don't need to, I, I'm, I'm, doing, I'm doing a service for my country and uh, pretty much the same, uh, the same thing you're supposed to doing, stu supposed to be doing, I'm doing it in a larger level. So the answer is no, you've never tried. I don't want to be a cop. Oh. Why would I want to be a police officer? Because it's so easy. Good cops don't make it far. You see, I've complained. I, I have over a thousand videos, okay? I've, I've gotten illegally arrested. I've gotten tossed on the ground. Guess what happens that, that as soon as we make it to court? Oh, 
Well, the charges are dismissed. Huh. And then what? I thought I was wrong, right? I thought I broke the law. I thought the cops said, oh, well, you're gone. You're coming with me. And then what? So they can dismiss the charges because you have no, you have nothing on me just because you were annoyed. You know how many times that's happened to me? Well, guess what? How does it feel to, how does it feel to be the one questioned? What's the common denominator in this situation? How does it feel to be the one question? How does it feel to be the one questioned and held accountable? How does it feel? You guys do that all the time, right? Well, here we are. Peacefully protesting, doing the same thing. You guys have a good weekend, okay? Are you an attorney? We need one right now. Very cool this is out, man. You can't swing a good cat without hitting five or six attorneys. Good. Well, when this viral gets thousands of views tomorrow, maybe somebody will contact me and say, hey, you want to sue the, uh, the Ohio State Police Patrol? And I'm going to say no. Because I don't want the people's money. So, just as we wrap this up here, we do have an officer who knows the job, and he at least upheld my First Amendment rights. He's not too. He's not too nice, though. You know what I'm saying? He but, may he, he may be smart and know his stuff. I give the credit. But he, he he's uh, unwilling to uphold he, it. He's yeah, exactly because he he would never go against any of these guys. So you know what I'm I, saying? I wonder. I wonder what uh, George Washington, Ben Franklin, Rosa Parks would think of this Fourth Amendment violation. You have to go through a certain person to get in. Then they scan your ID. Then they give you a name tag with your full name on it. Then you have your Second Amendment taken away. Then your Fourth Amendment. Then you then run into a guy with a German Shepherd. Which is also a violation of your Fourth Amendment. He took an oath to protect the Fourth Amendment, but literally his job is to subvert the Fourth Amendment as uh, on a We're daily checking basis. checking bag, sniffing so crotches. This, and this is why we go in here and do this, because this is the public's building. These people work for us. And if we are not participatory, then tyranny will abound. Correct. So that's unfortunately what happened. That's why we have millions of views, because we always catch you guys doing the wrong thing on video. Congratulations. Always. Knowing the Third Amendment, man. I was giving you Thank you for knowing the Third Amendment. You're actually, and we're not lying. I am, I am very sincere about everything. I may not like the attitude that, that you gave me a little bit of attitude, but I appreciate you knowing uh, about the Constitution, because nobody knows the Third Amendment. Well, I'll tell you what I'll do. I didn't realize I was giving you an attitude. I will work on it. Awesome. Deal? Awesome. Thank right, you. Brother. Thank you. You guys take care. All right? Thanks. You too. Now, I, I, now I, I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. And that's why Mr. America does what he does, guys. Right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And that's why Mr. America does what he does don't know their job these people said you can't be in here you can't film in there and we told them and then they actually learned to film back we got in there we had a rights violation but we're teaching lessons we're going to teach this whole country about our rights even if we have to do it by insulting them guys check out auditing america on every single platform thank you to the donation dollar sign auditing america news on cash up dollar sign fake mike real news check out auditing america on instagram check out auditing america on facebook fake mike real news got my own channel Go subscribe to me on that channel. Also, check out CPR Audits. CPR Audits, before we go, tell people about your brand new true crime channel. Oh, yeah. We go to serial killers' houses. We look for missing people. Um, we do all that shit. Just tell the people the name. Murder Man Studios. Guys. Murder Man Studios. Go find it. We're out, guys. Fake Mike. Real news.